Hi guys, I hope that everybody is doing well. So as you can see by the title of today's video, I am going to be sitting down and showing you my birthday glam. I am recording this video ahead of time because I do not want to work on my birthday. But this is the exact makeup that I am planning to do on my actual birthday. Um, I do this eye look all the time. It really is my go-to. It is such a simple one, yet every time that I do this eye look, I get so many compliments on this look, you guys. Um, I actually can't believe that I've never shown you this look on my YouTube channel before. Also, you guys, stay tuned to the end of the video for a giveaway. But I hope that you enjoy this tutorial. And yeah, guys, let's just get into it. <laughs> night that this primer seems to be changing its packaging and formula or something like that um, that makes me very sad I was looking to purchase a backup of this primer and um, I never really found it in store so actually wondering is Smashbox still in the country um, if anybody has seen their products please do comment down below and let me know um so sad you guys i hope that the new formula is just as good and they haven't changed things too much because i i really love how this primer sits underneath a lot of foundations so i'm gonna go ahead and fill in my eyebrows off camera and i'll be right back Okay guys, so I have filled in my brows using the Goof Proof uh, Brow Pencil and the 24 Hour Brow Setter. Both these products are from Benefit. I am going to be uh, color correcting my under eye area using this peach, uh, yeah it's peach bisque from Bobbi Brown. I love this product so much. Um, and I am just going in underneath the eye area because I have really um, dark under eyes. I don't know why. It's probably just in my genes or something like that. And then around my um, smile lines as well, I have. A lot of pigmentation there, so I'm just likely going in with a bit of that. Okay, guys, so let's move on to foundation. And in today's video, I am going to be using this foundation from L'Oreal. Um, I am in the shade 320, and this is caramel topping. The shade is slightly darker for my skin tone, but you guys know that I always like to go a bit darker than lighter. I did purchase this makeup tile from uh, Sanesh Makeup. It is an online store and I love having something like this to um, use for product you guys. I don't like things being on my hands and all these things. It's just so much more nicer having it like this on a makeup tile. Okay, and now I'm going to be uh, going in with a concealer brush and I'm, I use this just to clean up around my brow area. You probably could see that it looks a bit messy at the moment. So guys, for me, um, birthdays are always a time to reflect and just to plan new goals and things like that for the year. Um, I don't ever make new year's resolutions i usually do this for my birthday or just goals and things that i need to achieve um for a new year going ahead i did only use one pump of foundation for my 
my entire face let's go in with concealer i'm gonna be using the prep and prime pen from mac and this is in shade bright forecast one of my favorite products ever so yeah guys as i was saying um this year however with everything that has gone on i really am feeling very grateful i feel like i have a lot to be grateful for this year the past two years really have been a roller coaster right um you know i'm so grateful for family i'm so grateful for friends and most of all i'm so grateful that i have such an amazing husband he's always by my side always motivating me and uh, encouraging me to do whatever i set my mind to doing and yeah i'm really grateful uh, for having such an amazing person in my life god has really blessed me uh, with an amazing husband and i really am grateful for him last year hasn't been easy for anybody really um let's not forget the looting that has happened and with covid and we all have lost so many loved ones and so many people that were really close to us and i'm just so grateful for um everybody that i still have in my life today and yeah guys i really am hoping that 2022 is gonna be a much better year um it really has taught me to live in the moment and um be happy and be grateful for everything that you have achieved you know me personally i'm always trying to move on to the next thing and the next thing and it is really important to um take the time and appreciate what you have achieved now and everybody around you so yeah guys going into this birthday i really am feeling very grateful for everyone and for everything and for you guys my youtube channel as well thank you for all the support that you have shown me you guys i really do appreciate it and for all of your amazing feedback um it definitely does not go unnoticed or unheard so i'm going to be moving on to a contour and i'm going to be using an oldie but definitely a goodie and this is the la girl uh, pro high definition concealer and i am using this in the shade toast guys another year older and we definitely want to look snatched so i'm gonna be definitely uh, contouring today love how easily this uh, concealer from la girl blends out remember that with your contour uh, you always want to be moving the product in an upward side in an upward direction um, otherwise everything's gonna be dragging downwards and you are gonna be getting the opposite effect of what you want the contour into my hairline at this point because I did tell you previously that I have a large ass forehead so I think this is where I need it the most okay 
guys so now a very important step let's set all this makeup into place and for that i am using the mac mineralize skin finish and i am in the shade medium golden so let's use this In preparation for eyeshadow, I am going to be using uh, my Crayolan Concealer. And this is going to create a nice base for our eye look. Okay guys, so for birthday plans, I am going to be going out for supper night and then we are going to be going away for my birthday um, it is a Thursday and yeah but yeah we are going to be going away for the weekend um, I'm not sure exactly what my husband does have planned but I know that he does seem very busy so um, we'll have to check So whenever I contour, um, it is very important for me to bake and I'm going to be using this uh, powder from Revolution in the shade Banana. It does say that it is a baking powder and just to clean everything up, this step really does make a big difference you guys. And because I like to lean a lot, I am going to be baking underneath the chin area. Because we really need this makeup to look good for the whole night, you guys. And then I'm going to be baking underneath my eye area. Because we are going to be going in with eyeshadow. Okay, and I know I probably look pretty crazy at this point. But... It will all come together, I promise you. Okay, so I am going to be using this palette, actually one shade in the palette, from Creative Glamour. Uh, and guys, please do remember that you can use any um, products that you own. Please do not feel that you need to have the exact products that I use to achieve a certain look. It can be easily achieved by anything. So for this look, all you need is any maroon shade, similar to this, you can see it is just a maroon shade and, and just going in with windshield wiper motions, just going to be adding this to the eye area. So guys, I like to go in with a little bit of product by design and build it up slowly and this is gonna ensure that you have no harsh lines and um, it really does make a difference actually okay guys so now for the start of the show I am going to be going in with a loose pigment and this is in the shade chalk mint so I'm going to be going in with my setting spray to pick up the product and guys, um, this brand is called PMU. So guys, when I studied um, makeup, um, this brand was introduced to me and it is called PMU. I've never heard of this brand and I've never heard about it um, again. And, um, but this is the one product that i really have loved from it i know that mac does have a very similar shade and all i do with this is that i add it into the lid area and this eye look is as easy as that i have done this look 
so many times you guys and every time that i do this look i get a lot of compliments mm. this color is so stunning i'm definitely gonna see if max still uh, have this club but i'm really sure that they do and um i will tell you the exact name and details of it it really is a stunning shade so i'll be going back in with that brush and just blending everything in this really is one of the most simplest um, eye looks that i have done and yeah guys sometimes we really do not have time to be sitting there the whole time um, doing makeup and we need to get out the door but we still want to look cute so yeah this is a good one i'm just using more of the uh baking powder to clean up the under eye area going in with that very same shade i'm just going to be adding some onto the waterline just to tie up everything Okay, so for eyebrow highlights, I'm going in with the shade Gleam, and this is also from the same brand called PMU. Guys, I really do not know where this brand came from. Um, I really do think that it was one of the owners of the school that created this brand or something like this. I need to do more research on it actually. Um, but yeah, the two products that I have loved from the brand was the pigment and uh the shade called gleam for under brow um, highlight but yeah um i've seen similar shades in lots of other brands so yeah nothing that special actually just going in with that same shade is a very subtle shade um with some inner corner highlights as well and for mascara I'm going to be using the uh, Lash Paradise from L'Oreal ok guys so for lashes I am going to be using the drama queen lashes and this one is the pageant queen i was gifted this pack of lashes from neil ramata these lashes are really really beautiful and uh, yeah guys it is my birthday and i'm gonna be extra so um let me go ahead and put on these lashes and i will be right back Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and dust off this fake. Okay, let us um, set that contour, and for that, I'm gonna be using um, my Hoola bronzer from Benefit. I do have the mini size, so it comes with a small brush. I actually like to do my own contour. And for blush today, I'm going to be using this blush from MAC. It is in the shade Black Plum. And this is a sheer tone blush. Um, I love this shade so much, you guys. It is a really beautiful shade. looking to get a new blush I strongly recommend this one for highlighter today I am going to be using one of my favorite highlighters because it is my birthday and this is from Jaclyn going in with the shape major Just in my cupid's bow. 
I am feeling very powdery at this point and um, I need to melt down all the powder so I'm, going to, so I'm going to be using my MAC setting spray to do that today and that setting spray definitely did help uh, to bring this look to life I was looking really really powdery you guys and I like to take my um, beauty sponge and push the product into my skin for lipstick I'm gonna be going in with strip down from MAC as my lip liner okay so I'm feeling a brown lip for this look and I'm gonna be going in with this one from L'Oreal in 862 this is the chocolate uh, liquid lipstick I'm gonna try not to be too heavy handed with this one okay this applicator really does make it so much more easier to apply okay guys so this is my birthday look and before I let you go uh, I am doing a giveaway in honor of my birthday and guys I just wanted to give away uh, I know it is something really small but I just want to say thank you to each and every one of you I do really appreciate you guys more than you'll ever know and the first thing that you could win is this 25 eyeshadow pan from Duke Factory it is a really beautiful neutral one I'm not going to be opening it up for sanitary purposes because it is going to another home and then you know how important self-care is to me so I had to include something like that as well and one of my favorite brands is Coco Star and this is a sheet mask from them and as well as an eye patch guys this is a really awesome and I know that one of you guys are gonna be enjoying it and also included in it is a um, vanilla candle and guys I've repurchased this one so many times and um, I just love how it smells so all you have to do uh, to win this prize is be subscribed to my channel like this video comment anything with the hashtag giveaway and you will be entered guys it is as easy as that you can comment anything that you like and you will be entered and um i am planning to do this giveaway on my instagram stories but if you are not on instagram do not worry i will contact you nevertheless but um I like to do it there so that you guys see that it is fair I do use the random comment picker to choose my winner so yeah there is no favorites in this giveaway but yeah guys thank you so much for watching I appreciate you guys don't forget to enter the giveaway I will also be leaving the rules in the description bar down below and yeah guys thank you so much and I will talk to you in the next one Bye guys.